Okay, this is Mr. Davis with RHS TV, and I've got a video here, and I'm going to show you how to export it to YouTube, and then we're going to submit the link as an assignment. So this one, we've already uh, trimmed the interview. Well, the best part is uh, watching the kids uh, get pushed out of their comfort zone and growing and uh, getting challenged, doing something that they think they can't do, and climbing is perfect for that. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and split the clip right here. And then take out this next question. Do you feel that by taking these students on this adventure, it could help them in the future? For sure. Um, they're going to be hit. Okay. We, he's not restating the question, which we should have made him do. But we're going to see if we can make this work. Uh, um, they're going to be hit in the face for the rest of their life with things they think they can't do. And um, maybe they'll think back to this climbing trip and, and think, but they can't do that and then they get up there and they do it and so it shows them they can do things that they think they can't do all right i'm going to end it right there and um delete that last clip and i'm going to go in here since i don't have b-roll and just add a little quick transition and uh then i'm going to show you how to do the export part is uh, watching the kids uh, get pushed out of their comfort zone and growing and uh, getting challenged. Okay, now the next thing you're going to do is we're going to go in here, we're going to export this video. So to do that, I'm going to go here to File, Share, and then I'm going to create a master file. And then from that, I will upload it to YouTube. So I'm going to do master file here. And I'm going to call this, I'm going to change the name, I'm going to call it Belk Interview. Uh, and the text here, that's what will show up in your YouTube. If you do a file, you can't really see it. This is an, a deal I've used from before. So this is at 4K. I'm going to change the setting here to 1080p so the file won't be so big. And I'm going to export that. To, I'm going to put it on the desktop where it's easy to find and then I'm going to hit save and it'll show you right here your percentage completion and so that's going to take a few minutes so I'm going to stop this recording and then I'll pick it up once we get the final video. Okay this is Mr. Davis I'm back I'm going to show you how to take that video that you just saved and to put it into Final Cut Pro. Now the one way probably the easiest and quickest way is to go directly from Final Cut Pro or whatever your editing software is so you click right here and go to YouTube and then you can do it from here there's your settings uh, but you can also get it from over here from the drop down menu from share. Uh, but one of the things I found out is sometimes that will fail, especially if you're using a student account. So what I, sh uh, what I would suggest is what I showed you earlier is to go ahead and just make a file, make a video file, make a master file right here. And so once you do that, then you can take that master file. So, uh, let me go in here and pull up Final Cut Pro or, uh, YouTube I've already logged into the account and you can click on this little upload button here and then that will let you do one of two things it'll let you either grab a file and drag it into here you can just grab it and drag it and drop it over here or you can go down here to add more videos or you can go in here and just find it through the the finder uh, either way will work so like here's you can go in there and you can actually upload one right after the next you just go in there and find the file wherever you want to and it'll name the file whatever the name is on your file so you can you can change it um, and then while it's editing, once you're ready to edit it, see, I don't want to do this one, so I'm going to go in here and I'm going to cancel this one. Uh, I'll cancel that upload, yes. And this one, uh, it says how long it takes, 10 minutes. 
So you can decide if you want to make it public, unlisted, or schedule it to come at a separate time. And then this is where you type in your description. This is where you put your tags or like what kids would call clickbait. So if you want, if people do searches, uh, they can find your video from the, from the tags you put in here. And then a custom thumbnail will let you, the, the uh, software will automate, or YouTube will automatically pick three choices for a thumbnail and you can change it and put a new one in. So I'm gonna show you here going, I'm gonna go into the Creator Studio and I'm gonna pull up uh, the last video here that I did and show you how you can go in and change it. So it's given me three choices. The two little logos there, I don't want that. So I, I want this as my background. So I'll leave that. If I wanted to put a custom one, I just click on there and go into Finder. So that's how you do it. It'll upload and once you do, if you wanted to go in and edit it, you can just, like I said, showed you earlier, go into the Creator Studio, and this will show all your videos here. And so I've got 738 videos here, and it shows you this little world deal means it's public, and this shows that there's copyright material on there. Uh, and like this one here that has a little uh, unlisted link, that's one that I've made that you can't, it's not public, but you, if you have the link, you can get it. All right, so that's all, and thanks for watching, and on to the next part of the video. I got one more uh, step. We go to our home page here, and what, you pick the class you're in. Uh, we're gonna go to fundamentals, and let's go to one of these assignments here where it says to uh, submit your completed interview using forms, or you can submit it on a flash drive. But So you go in here and you type in your name, your email, and I'm going to go here where it tells you to put your link. So to find that, you go here on YouTube to your video. Here's the video. Okay, this is Mr. Davis with RHS TV. And so I'm, I'm going to find the video, and then I'm going to go right here, and I'm going to get a copy of the link to it, and I'm going to hit... Uh, command copy and then I'm going to take this link I'm going to test it first I'm going to go right here and see if it'll work I'm going to tape push it in there yep it pulls up okay, there's this is Mr. Davis. there's my video okay so next I'm going to go in and take that link and I'm going to paste it right here command V paste okay and then you can answer the rest of your questions and hit submit. So all you do is go to wherever you've uploaded the video, right here, and then copy the link, Command C, and then come right over here to your form. You can use the same browser, but I ha I'm in a different browser because I'm signed in. This YouTube account's in the school name, and this one's in my name. So. If you're in the same uh, same name, you don't have to switch browsers. That's a little trick I use. So, uh, and there's just a few questions. I try to keep it real simple. What class are you in? Who'd you interview? Uh, so like right here, you put uh, Mr. Belk. Uh, how many of the steps did you fill? So you need to look at the rubric and figure that out. Who helped you complete the interview? Just type the name. And then give yourself honest evaluation here. And this should take about five minutes or less to do it. So click submit, and it's going to say, hey, you can't submit it because you didn't fill all this out. But when you guys do it, fill it out. All right, so I try to make these really easy to find, and I hope this helps. Some of you guys have been struggling on this. If you still can't figure out how to do it, print it off and write it out on paper. And you can handwrite it. And turn the form, turn the video in on the flash drive. I don't care. But the main thing is, you've got to finish the video because if you don't export it and finish it, then it's not done. So we want you to do everything from setting up the tripod to exporting the video. So uh, this is the thing I've noticed a lot of you aren't turning it in. So hopefully this video will help. And for RHS TV, this is Scott Davis signing off.